community. Good morning. Oh my goodness. Animals everywhere. I know. <laughs> so I had a, a interesting thing happen to me about three o'clock, four o'clock this morning. Yeah. Actually oh, yeah. woke Kevin up. I was in a dead sleep, which doesn't happen to me often. So I was tired and I was really in a dead sleep. I woke up because, I mean, it actually woke me up. My hands, <laughs> my hands were, just my hands were so itchy. I washed them, hot water, cold water, put lotion on them, scrubbed them, washed them again, everything. I couldn't get them to stop for a good, I'm going to say a good 45 minutes before I woke Kevin up. And then I woke Kevin up and he had some anti-itch cream. And we put that on it and then it was probably within about 15, 20 <laughs> minutes I was able to go back to sleep. But I had taken Benadryl hoping that would help it and that didn't even help it. What are you doing? <laughs> So it was just crazy. It's fine now. But I was even using. Let me show you if I can find it. <clears throat> yep, right here. I was even using this brush. It's a wire brush to cut, brush the cat's hair. I just scratched my hands. <laughs> That's nice. That's how bad it was. It was miserable. So I didn't sleep. Well, because I've pretty much been up since 3 o'clock um, with my hands going and couldn't get back to sleep. So I'm going to take a nap. <laughs> Good idea. Talk, tell them about what you got on Instagram. Oh! Oh! Ah, ah, ah. I woke her up, didn't it, Boomer? That woke her up. I was so excited to see this. Riding with Norman. Uh huh. He followed me back. Cool. I'm getting followed by Norman Reedus. I love you. I can't believe it. When I saw that, I was like, ah, 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 ah. I, I'm so. Can I say friggin'? Sure. I'm so friggin' excited! <laughs> it's okay, Boomer. This is normal for her. It okay, was, I uh, when I saw Riding with Norman, that's his other show that he does, guys, where he rides his motorcycles. Of course I watch that, too. Because anything with Norman, I have to watch. Uh -huh. um, when I saw that you know you get to see somebody <laughs> start following you and you know I don't always pay attention until I go in and I look at the list and I saw riding with Norman started following you and I'm like ah, ah, ah. I came out of the room and I'm like look look uh, guess guess who started following me <laughs> yeah. and we were at Bambi and Kiersey's and Kiersey's like Calm down! <laughs> and Bambi's like, Jeez. who is this? <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. So, but, anyway, I'm going to take a nap. We got Taylor coming over today to pick up some more um, stuff for the Halloween party. Um, and, uh, what are you doing today, baby? I have to install a couple more uh, ceiling fans. I have a guy who wanted four installed, so he's got two more I'm going to install today. So, and then I'll comment back. Hopefully it won't take too long and I will help Taylor with whatever he needs for his Halloween party. And um, you got a bid on Sunday, right? Yeah. So, and you got a job, what, from Anita for when? Uh, don't know. 
someone's moving out and I need to paint a room. So the jobs are coming in, guys. Yeah, um, Keep slowly. those thoughts and prayers and, you know. Yeah. Everything positive coming our way and hopefully we can save the house. Alrighty, so I'm on my way to do another job. I'm going to be installing some ceiling fans. Uh, hopefully I can get two of them done today. That would be great. Now hopefully it won't take too long. Actually just replacing old ones so uh, existing hardware should be in the ceiling already so I don't have to worry about bracing. They do want a um, fan where a hanging light used to be so that needs to be braced. So I will probably go to Home Depot right now to uh, get that bracing before, uh, or at least see if I can afford the bracing. Just one of those uh, bars that you tighten between ceiling joists. So that's where I'm going right now. Hey guys, so Kevin ran to the post office for me today because he had to mail a package and we got mail. Looks like a Halloween card. Ooh, I see ghosts. Cheers! A ghost toast. Oops. Cool. Val and Kevin celebrate the day with lots of booze. Happy Halloween. Jen Frost. <laughs> and lots of booze that booze, way. Booze! Booze! And she wrote a little something. Hi, it's Jen. You know me as Jen's KSM. Jen's KSM. Yeah, I always n never know how to pronounce that. Jen's Jen and, and KSM. That's my name and kids' names. Just wanted to say thank you for the kind words about SSI going through a very bad time and I appreciate it. I hope you feel better and we'll keep you in my prayers. Well, thank you very much, um, Jen, and um, if you have any questions, I went through it several years ago and um, I know each state is a little different, but... Uh, we understand the hoops you jumped through. Yeah. So if you have any questions, just set, shoot me an email or a private message on Instagram or whatever, and I'll be happy to answer any questions you may have. And that's our first Halloween card. Yep, and you're our first one. Yay. So, And I got your address now, so look forward to something coming in the mail out to you. Hello again, everybody. <laughs> it's been a weird day. I've been sleeping most of the day. Yeah. After being manic for several days, that's usually what'll happen is I'll crash. And after having the weird three o'clock in the morning itchy hand thing. So I've been asleep most of the day. Um, I forgot to tell everybody the great news about Megan. So I want to tell you guys all what happened with Megan. She is done with her pre-vet, so now she has to go to veterinarian college to become an official DVM. And she's applied to four co of the top veterinarian colleges. And I don't know the names of them all. And there's one in Arizona. Seven, well, eight days ago now is when they opened up their application process. And she was one of the first groups to submit, and she got an interview right away. So she has to go to Arizona for an interview. Cool. So they were real impressed with her application and letters of recommendation and all of that. Well, I had a weird day. So. Yeah. I had to, um, to replace two fans. First one went super easy, uh, went up without a problem, works fine, had a, a remote for it and the light, it's very very well made. The second one was over a pool table that I had to put up a um, scaffolding kind of setup that I have that's kind of rickety but it worked. 
I put that up and the uh, motor hummed on the uh, that fan. Uh, fan. And uh, I told the guy, says it's up and you know it's fine except it's noisy. It's a noisy fan. So um, he um, wants thought about it, it and then he wants me to take it back down and uh, take it. We're gonna take it back to Home Depot and get another one and what a drag. So that'll probably be Monday tomorrow. I go look at another job and that's about it. What are you doing? Why aren't you over there with mommy? And I colored a picture to look like... I just dropped something. To look like Annabelle, um, Jake and Jordan's little girl. Mmm, cute. Yeah. So I did that in between my naps. <laughs> <laughs> so, but anyway, we're going to go ahead and call it an evening. We hope you enjoyed a little bit of something that you may have seen in our video today. If you did, please leave us a favorite. Please share our video with your family and friends. Leave us a comment down below. But, most of all, please subscribe. And we will see you all tomorrow. Ta-ta for now. I love you. Right.